Assalamu alaikum, my name is Mama Zishan and you are watching now my YouTube channel PK Skills. Now we are going to put, uh, import uh, some WooCommerce products uh, using custom fields. If, if our uh, products have some custom fields and uh, we want to import via CVS file, then you can see this product, this product have these custom fields, for example, internal memory, battery capacity, processor RAM and these are also line date, network and body, display features and CPU. These all are custom fields. If, if we edit this product, I can show you in the back end. You can see product specifications field. These are custom fields. Uh, for example, processor, camera and internal storage. And if we go around uh, other fields, uh, uh, other fields, I can open here. You can see network detail, launch details and everything so these are custom fields and uh, i have created these uh, fields using advanced custom fields products if uh, uh, as custom fields advanced custom fields you can see this this um, this uh, you know plugin so i have created these fields i now i want to import a bunch of prior products or a list of products uh, using a cvs file uh, into my uh, woocommerce store so let's start my tutorial so here you can see I have a file where I have you know uh, my custom fields data for example light details body display details that are custom fields I have in my you know in my uh, in my product page in my product edit page in uh, also in my product front end page and uh, back end page so now we we gonna import it via csv file uh, in, in within few seconds I, I show you some steps so you just need to follow and import them so first of all i have this plugin if you need this plugin you can subscribe my channel and you know, request this plugin i will send you the link of this plugin so just click on import and here is the import just click on just click on import not export here you just need to click on product just click on next step and then then select uh, the file select the local then select the file that you are import so i have a file in my pc and here here is the nokia mobiles file actually so i want to import the nokia mobiles file here just click on mapping so now the final step where we gonna map our products product title so just for, for for first you just need to map the product title so here we search the product title here you can see product title if i show you my file here you can see my product title is um, product label product title here here you can see product title and product title is nokia n9 2029 so if you see here the product title is nokia n9 2009 just click on use expression then go down go down and go down and here we uh, select the price so just click on regular price just click on here and then here we set the product uh, title of the column so here is 899 so if I show you uh, my file so here is uh, the regular price regular price so here I have selected my regular price then I have to select the uh, product image so I am going to select the product image here is image if I uh, click here and if she says image HRV so image here is yeah sorry so here here you can see image hrf so here i have to select my image just use this expression then product title product as these are some meta tags you can select or not select just go to taxonomy and here is the product type if you if your product have variable products you, you can write here variable but our product is simple just click on category i have to select my product category so i click here and search for category and here you can see my category is nokia then uh, i have to select tags and i have searching my tags sorry 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 tags so here i have to select tags so for now for this product I don't have uh, tags but some products have 
then I have product brand so my category is also a brand and I just click here and category and mapping is as a brand then now is the final step for my meta custom fields the custom fields that I have in my front end and also I have shown into uh, into the back end so if we just need to we just need to Im Im map them these uh, meta fields uh, custom fields and then you can in easily import it just click on here and here uh, I am going to share there is battery if I show you my my file if I show you here is the battery and uh, j just show and camera battery here hey you can see battery so this is the battery field I want to import and uh, another field is uh, battery details and I, I just search your battery details and battery details then body details I have this custom field body details sorry body is uh, body details this is the names of headings of my uh, uh, you know CSV file uh, columns then camera I search here for camera and camera I search here sorry 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 camera and here I just use this expression and then here's the camera details and I just uh, camera details here and I have to commas here is commas C O M L M S commas there is the details and I have also um, display 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 di display only and I have to show some display details also in the custom field display details this is the custom field and here is another one is uh, features I search as features features here I just use this expression and internal storage I just search here internal storage and internal storage here, here my this uh, next field then is the now line detail is my my you know while uh, column and here is launch then uh, memory details uh, here is memory details here is the memory details and then um, RAM is my random access memory of this product here and here is the um, MIC MIS details MISC details here I just use this expression and then network details I just search here network details yeah you can see network details then I search for platform details I just search here platform because I have this um, column in my uh, file then processor I just search here for processor and then map these all one by one and uh, here is the sound I search here for sound details and here is I am going to show you um, tests I don't have any tests field and attributes if you have some attributes for your you know product you can also import them and uh, no other fields but for now we have these custom fields I, I want to import them into the uh, you know uh, uh, WooCommerce so we we recheck them we have product title which we, we should make sure we should have product title at least and a regular price of any product at least then a product image we should have a product image a category tags if we don't have tags we can just this uh, click is and uh, product we ran and everything I have now mapped we just need to import them into the product just click on here advanced and then you scroll up here you can see a update only if uh, the entire data from the input file pressed from an update on the case if if you are going to update existing product you just need to click here yes then it's be not then uh, product made by SKU you have SKU and want to update uh, already you know added products you can do that if product is in store then skip no we we need to update or skip that, that's it and then it's saying it complete with ID just keep that or import as a new import as a new then click here and import it just click on import and just wait up for a second and within few seconds I, I here you can see there are you know, new products are Apple products so just I refresh here you can see here uh, the process is under uh, you know process 
but here you can see some of products our products will be imported uh, you know automatically because this this is an under process this is our under process so that's why it's here some of products will yeah here you can see Nokia 2008 18 Nokia 2018 if we uh, view here you can see I can show you here yes there you can see I have internal storage camera battery details processor detail display and random access memory and all these custom fields details if I edit this product you can see uh, let me let me show you yes this is under process let me show you how how it has been imported let me show you mm, yes yes this one and uh, this, 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 this one, this one, this one, this one. Hey, you can see this is also custom field, noise detail. So, this custom field data is also important. This custom field, all the custom field data is important. Hey, you can see tags are important. And you can see here the Nokia category is also been added. So, all the these, uh, you know, custom fields data has been added. And you can see all the custom fields data has been added, price, and here you can see the product image as well as everything i have uh, added it uh, via csv file into my woocommerce store so if you have liked my video just subscribe my channel and put the uh, hands up like button and subscribe my channel if you need this plugin you can subscribe and just comment below if you need any help you can uh, you know click my father account link and uh, hire me for your project thank you so much for watching this video and don't forget to subscribe my channel